Okay, I'll try that again. Uh, uh, afternoon, evening. Uh, evening, guys. Welcome to Wednesday the 24th. Uh, hopefully you can see our right the back window as it's a little bit grubby. It's just the dust from the hay that's been making. So, day three. It's, uh, yeah, back to old faithful being on the back. What I will do is I'll go through and when we're, when we're all done and squared up, nailed up and tied up, I will go through exactly what has been happening. But uh, safe to say, I'm about to scrap that hay bomb. Sorry, not the hay bomb, the hay tender. Uh, I'll throw it in the bottom of the hedge today. I've had enough. Um, Thank you for the guys who keep uh, suggesting stuff, but it's just simply the fact that this is 20, 25 years old or something. I can't remember now. She's from the mid, kind of mid 90s. I think. Anyway, um, so yeah, she's no spring chicken, and she's well past the second life and probably on to a ninth life by now must be a cat. <coughs> uh, so yeah, I got fed up with it. So, back to this. Uh, I also made the decision to give up my eight acres of my own, which is going to kick me up the ass. But, such is life. And I've given it to a mate of mine who's a sheep farmer anyway. <coughs> um, reason being, was I cut everything expecting to be using that big hay tether as I'm not using that big hay tether and using this everything's taking quite a long time oh, before anybody mentions it yes I'm going the wrong way around my hay bob <coughs> um, yeah so I gave it to him place going down there yesterday and mowed it uh, I hadn't tethered it I've not tethered it today either I just have not had time to do it. So it's now seven o'clock I think. So about like that. And I'm on this is the second time I've tended this field. I've tended two more fields. Two more fields twice? Yeah. And once once. Uh, I'm hoping to try and get a couple more turns in today before I get to two now. Well, my sister's coming in, should I say. So, yeah, been a bit, bit of a peak this year. Uh, the whole reason for buying that big tether was to try and improve my chances of making more hay. So, it's all gone a bit pear shaped. Like I say, I've not got into Merck yet, into MB track. You're probably wondering why that is. Well, I've got to travel past all the estate's fields to do the little contract job that we've got and to go and do my fields. And by the time I'm a mile and a half away from the yard, to do a mile and a half back to go change to the other tractor into the MB track and re really travel that mile and a half covering three miles which isn't a lot I'm over I've got to go across the main road on a junction so it just all takes time and every every minute counts I'm going up and down the lane you can have a really good run where it takes you 15 minutes to get down the lane or oh, I've just got a wrong living road hang on a minute guys uh, it might take you 15 minutes or uh, if you meet everybody else it could take you 25 it's just one of them lanes uh, right, let's go for this one. That's for me talking. So yeah, I, uh, I've had a word with the contractor because the rain's forecast for Friday no, early, early afternoon, 2 o'clock. Uh, I've still got this field to bail, the estate's farings field to bail, the little paddock to bail and the customers to bail. I'll try and bail on mine, which wasn't going to happen. So, 
yeah. Uh, contractors in with, I've met with, with the four abandoned, so I think it's a crown that he's got. Is it 1990? 1980s or something like that. Um, so I've got set up with him to go and do that. Should be good. Just takes pressure off me for an hour of messing around. So tomorrow's job will be setting out again in the morning. And then I think I will be rowing up, which I am surprised myself. Uh, this is turning quite well, it's a bit, everything's a bit damp in the headlands, where the hedges are, which is fair enough to be fair. Uh, yeah, the sun just hasn't got to it quite as long, and the breeze hasn't quite got to it quite for so long. So, uh, yeah, we'll see. I might just, I don't know, we'll see, I might row them up, I might not. I'm going to have to move them, otherwise we don't row them anyway. So, yeah, we'll give the big, we'll see what the road to rate brings tomorrow. That's going to go two, one of two ways again. As long as he doesn't follow his brother on that, Ted will be alright. Anyway, I'm going to shut up, and you can watch me Check it out this grass a bit more. And my weird and wonderful ways, which I'm sure somebody won't like. Like the bitch. Oh, and I'm going quite slow as well. I'm only doing eight k's. I just want to make sure everything's off the floor now. And lift it up to the top. And to be fair, my back's gonna be now. <laughs> There's so many rough fields.
just to make some people happy.